So what is going on everyone, this is Fabi here and today we are going to unbox these beauties. These are basically my third pair uh, of headphones. I first of all had a uh, Sennheiser pair that I used on my computer, second uh, were the Turtle Beaches that I used on my Xbox, the X11s I think. And these are the Urban Ears Platon or Platoon, whatever the f*** they're called, uh, the Mokka or I think it's called Mokka in English. Uh, if you guys are from Romania, you probably know that Mokka in our language means free or basically just free. First of all, I'd like to take a look at the back side of the box. You can see we have some features of the uh, headphones. The one that I like the most, I will talk about later on. But first of all, or second of all, let's get to the unboxing. Um, as you can see, it's really nice, really nicely packaged. And if you wonder why it's actually kind of broken over here, it's because my friend over here who's filming. I'm very grateful for uh, because he's doing all this work destroyed the box basically he just ruined it now let's take a look and here we have the headphones uh, the color is very nice and I do think that this is going to last for quite some time I didn't want to get uh, a very light color because I know or I knew that that would get very um, very muddy and very very bad looking very fast and personally I do take care of my things in general or everything that I own but I did not want to, um, you know, get a color that would be very prone to um, to mud and to dirt and to everything. So here are the headphones. There's not really much else to it other than uh, some sort of adapter, which is a uh, neutral stereo plug. I don't even know what this is supposed to actually do. My friend Dennis just informed me what this actually does. And in fact, it stops the microphone from working apparently. I don't know why that would be. Uh, helpful but apparently that's what it does now let's take a look at what we have in the box as well here is a very beautiful uh, manual that I've also seen in some of the other videos it's very colorful and it's also got some information as you can see it's just all about colors and this is basically what I've seen uh, that Urban Ears is all about the sound quality as far as I've heard is very good uh, but we are going to take a look at that later on but the fact is that they really make their uh, headphones look very pretty and I appreciate that. Here is something else, uh, the warranty and we also have a sticker that is in form or in shape of a heart. I think we are actually going to use this for all of our videos. We are going to uh, place it somewhere over here and it's going to look fine, nice and dandy. So now let's take a look at the headphones themselves. As you can see, they're a really light or a really small package when you actually bundle them up. And uh, they're really easy to carry around because they're really light and you don't really uh, feel like you're being bogged down by your headphones uh, because that's one of the fears I've had before buying these. Uh, but they're actually really nice to carry around and if we actually open them up, you will see that they look very nice and they're, um, they're really high quality I would say for this price point at least they're probably the best uh, headphones you can get uh, I'm actually going to put them on my head right now so you can see how they uh, fit my my head basically and uh, so let's take a look they really do sit on my um, ears very comfortably and I can barely hear what I'm talking about so I might be talking a little bit more loudly uh, but they're really nice and I feel like they do provide some noise cancellation but now I'm actually going to try them out or test them out with my iPod on Spotify and see how they actually sound Holy shit. okay so I listened to about 30 seconds of audio right now on my headphones or my new headphones and I can probably say that these were worth the money I personally paid about um, 40 UK pounds on them I don't know how that would translate to US dollars probably around 55 I would say and they do sound very, very awesome. One of the things that I personally like is the fact that the noise cancellation, uh, while passive, it works great. And I couldn't hear what my friend was saying, and I believe that he was talking fairly loudly, and I couldn't hear a damn thing of that. So I do think that these are going to be nice when you're on the plane or when you're taking a ride out to, you know, to work basically, commuting or something. These are probably the best headphones for this price range and I do have some others to test over here. These are the Bose AE2, the wireless edition, but I would use them with a cable. So let's try them out. 
Okay, now that I've listened to these as well, I can say that noise cancellation is not as effective as on these ones. It's probably because my ears are smaller and this covers my ear better, but I would personally not pay about 100 and something bucks more on these just for the wireless um, capability. These are really great. Expect a review soon on my channel if you want to know more about these. Like this video, share it with your friends on Facebook and on Twitter, subscribe to my channel and to my uh, cameraman's editor's friend's channel over here, Anthony Dennis at Apple Help Romania. Uh, so peace out guys, peace, have an awesome day, stay tuned.